you want to earn more free GPU hours on Mid Journey or even save on the GPU hours you have, here's a few things you can do to actually make that happen. The first thing you're going to want to do is log in to the midjourney.com website with your account and you're going to see here rate images on the left. If I click on that, your nurse says up here, top 2000 daily rankers get a free GPU hour. So you basically go through and rate which images you think are best. Now, I've heard people say they get away with 40 or 50 a day and they get one GPU hour for that if they can sort of get in the top 2000. And if you want to see exactly how much you got, head down to your account on the bottom here, go to manage subscription, and you'll notice here under usage details, bonus. And you see I've got zero hours here because I haven't rated any images. But if I go in and rate which images I think are best, I think this one looks the best. I can just repeat that process, do 40 or 50 images a day or more if this becomes more popular and earn some free GPU time. Keep in mind this footage is sped up. I'm not just clicking anything. So do make sure you do an honest job of choosing which images you prefer. And then within the following days, I can go back down into my subscription and see how many hours I've earned. One thing to remember is that anytime you can also buy more fast hours. So even though it's not free, if you need an extra hour or two, you can always go in and buy them pretty cheap. Also, I highly recommend if you can afford it moving up to the standard plan, it ends up being cheaper per image and then you also get access to relax mode. And I'm gonna give you a few more tips to save time around that also. One thing I can do if I have that $30 plan is type in slash relax and I can switch to relax mode. And this means that any images I create will not use fast hours. They'll be a little bit slower, but I will not use any of my paid GPU hours. I can basically go unlimited with this plan. However, you can't do things such as permutations or repeats. So if I go a cool picture, repeat five, hit yes. And it says it is only for fast mode. And if I do the same with permutations, if you're not sure what permutations and repeat are, essentially it allows you to create more images in one prompt. But if I try that, hit yes. Again, fast mode needs to be enabled. So you do lose access to some features, but I mean, if you're looking to try and get some images out, it's a good way to go. And if you are using fast mode, which you can go back to by typing in slash fast. For one, I recommend avoiding turbo mode if you want to save on hours, because it does use more GPU hours, but avoid using repeat and permutations anyway, because you will tend to chew up your hours creating images you may not like. Create one at a time, make your adjustments, and you will save on GPU hours that way. Another tip is upscaling. If I use upscale two or upscale four, especially upscale four uses about six times the amount of GPU power than generating a grid of images does. So if you upscale a lot, you're gonna chew right through your hours really quickly, but there's a few things you can do to save on it. For one, you can do all of your upscaling in relax mode. So I go slash relax, I go upscale by four and it will start the upscale. What I also recommend possibly doing even more than more so on that is actually getting an external upscaler and using that instead. And that way you actually don't even have to worry about it being in the queue of your mid journey feed. You can download the images and upscale them straight away. Go back to generating images. Use an upscaler such as Upscale, which is free, or if you want the best results, use Topaz Gigapixel or Topaz Photo AI. I have a video on the screen right now which compares the quality difference between these upscalers and the Mid Journey upscaler. So I highly recommend checking that out because it does make a big difference to the quality of your images. So I hope you enjoyed the video and found it useful. Have a great day and I'll see you again soon.